Armyworms are common turf pests found in the southern United States. They're known to target crop vegetables and gardens, but they'll also target and infest turf grass as a viable food source. Some lawns might already have a few armyworms, but populations can spike, accompanied with an increase in lawn damage. So in this video, we'll show you how to identify and get rid of armyworms in your lawn so your grass can stay green and healthy throughout the year. To shop for the products featured in this video and learn even more about armyworm control, click the icon on the top right of the screen or click the link in the description below. The first thing you should do in any pest control plan is identify what exactly you're dealing with. Your grass can die for many reasons, from fungus to pests to stress factors. Armyworms are the larvae of certain moths in the genus Spodoptera. They grow to be about 1 to 1 1.5 inches in length with brown, green, or black bodies. Their bodies are striped long ways with recurring pale stripes and a darker stripe on each side. Armyworms have brown to light brown head capsules, and their heads often feature a Y shape. Armyworms get their names because they travel in groups as they feed on turf grasses. Armyworm activity can be spotted from summer to early fall. In years that see more than average rainfall in August or September, you can expect higher armyworm counts in the upcoming summer. With high activity, you'll notice that patches of discolored or brown grass will start to form. The longer the infestation goes on, the larger the patches will get. If ignored, these patches can easily spread to sizes larger than most residential lawns. Inspection is the next phase of any good pest control plan. Once you know what your pests look like, check around your property to confirm their presence and find hot spots of activity. Check your lawn for patches of brown, discolored, or dying grass. Ideally, you would spot these patches early, but if the patch is large, you might notice that the patch has a clear origin point where eggs could have been laid. Activity will spread from there as the armyworms march across your lawn. Armyworms are active in the early morning, late evening, and nighttime. During the day, they'll hide under debris and thatch, underneath soil, or under plants. To coax them into coming out, you can flush them out from hiding by pouring a solution of one tablespoon of dishwashing soap and one gallon of water over suspected patches. Pour one gallon over one square yard at a time, and any armyworm should surface within a few minutes. After identifying your pests and inspecting your activity on your property, it's time to start treatment. Before starting any treatment, be sure to wear your personal protective equipment or PPE, and remember to keep all people and pets off the treated areas until dry. To get rid of armyworms in your lawn, you'll need to use insecticides labeled for armyworm control like Bifen LP and Reclaim IT. Bifen LP is a granular insecticide that will need to be watered into the soil, so we also recommend following up with a broadcast treatment of Reclaim IT. Both these products work on contact with the pest. These insecticides together create an effective one-two punch, providing both surface and subsurface control, effectively eliminating armyworms from all areas of your lawn. To start, calculate your treatment area's square footage by measuring the area's length and width and then multiplying them together. You'll use this to determine how much product you'll need. Since treating just the spots you found armyworms in won't guarantee that they haven't moved to other areas, you'll make a broadcast treatment over your entire lawn with both products. Begin by applying the Bifen LP granules with a push spreader to apply the labeled rate of 1.15 pounds of product per 1,000 square feet of treatment area. Load your spreader with the proper amount of Bifen LP based on your calculations and evenly distribute it throughout your treatment area. Broadcast half your granules in parallel lines once across your area, then broadcast the other half at a perpendicular angle to cover the area in its entirety. Once you've finished your Bifen LP application, it'll need to be watered into the soil to reach the turf's root zone. Do this with an application of Reclaim IT. Reclaim IT is a liquid insecticide concentrate, so it'll need to be mixed with water before application. Reclaim won't only aid in activating the Bifen granules, but it'll also provide effective control of armyworms and control of many other insects. To treat armyworms with Reclaim, apply the labeled rate of 0.18 to 0.25 fluid ounces of Reclaim IT per thousand square feet of treatment area. If your lawn is seeing heavy activity from armyworms, you can use a rate as high as one fluid ounce of Reclaim IT per 1,000 square feet. We recommend using a 20 gallon hose end sprayer since you'll make broad applications throughout the entire lawn and you'll want to use enough water to push the bifin granules down into the soil. To treat isolated areas of turf, you may also use a one gallon hand sprayer. To use the 20 gallon hose end sprayer, remove the reservoir from the nozzle. Make sure the sprayer's control valve and your water pump are off, then attach the nozzle to the hose. Add the proper amount of Reclaim IT, then fill the reservoir with enough water to treat the entire lawn. To make sure you thoroughly coat the area and water in the bifin granules, use at least two gallons of water per thousand square feet of treatment area. Double check to make sure your control valve and water pump are still off, then reattach the reservoir to the nozzle. Once you've ensured a tight connection, you can now turn the water on. To spray, push forward on the control valve. To stop, simply pull the valve back 
into the off position. To kill armyworms in your lawn, evenly distribute the entire amount of product over your treatment area. As you make your application, keep an eye on the amount of product you have left in the sprayer's reservoir. When the liquid in the reservoir runs out, no product will be applied. Once you finish applying Reclaim, postpone any regular irrigation or mowing in the area for at least 24 hours. That being said, make sure you've checked ahead of time to ensure it won't rain. When using Reclaim IT, be sure to apply on calm days when wind speeds are low to minimize drift. Prevention is essential to keeping pests off your lawn. Even after you've applied pesticides, the best way to stop armyworm activity is to make sure it can't happen again. Armyworms are easily suppressed by their natural predators, so do what you can to expose common hiding spots. Rake your lawn regularly to remove thatch and fallen leaves and pick up any yard debris that might get in the way. Proper lawn maintenance will also strengthen your lawn, giving it a chance to recover from small armyworm infestations. Trim back overhanging tree branch to reduce shade and promote proper water retention in your soil. Give your lawn one to one and a half inches of water once a week and mow your grass to a taller height, about three to four inches to encourage root growth. Finally, make sure you fertilize your lawn with the proper amount of nitrogen it needs so it can stay healthy and fight against pest symptoms. Armyworms may be highly destructive, but there are ways to manage and control an infestation that's gone out of hand. With these professional products and tips from Solutions Pest and Lawn, you can stop armyworms from destroying your lawn, and we offer same-day shipping to help you get control quickly. Visit our website to get your products today. If you like this how-to guide, please share. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe for more how-to and product videos, and contact us for more tips, tricks, and DIY pest solutions.